Here's the inside scoop on what's new in MicroStation Connect Edition Update 14. You can now use AccuDraw controls to create non-orthogonal cuts on solids using the Cut Solids with Curve tool, significantly speeding a variety of modeling tasks. Update 14 adds the ability to choose between rounded and sharp corner offsets while offsetting solid edges. We've added the ability to place the constraint at the midpoint of any edge of an object. This replaces the previous workflow of having to place a fixed point or construction element at the midpoint. You can now more easily access help from the help icon in the top right corner of the ribbon. We've improved startup performance by allowing you to choose not to display file thumbnails of recent design files on the work page. Update 14 enables you to control the display of an element for each named presentation view. This new capability enables you to associate item types in the field type while creating or managing a text favorite in the text favorites manager dialog. You might use this, for example, for item type integration with title blocks. You can now access the V8i task theme and its various styles from the V8i button next to the workflow drop-down menu in the quick access toolbar. It's no longer constrained to the navigation workflow. You can synchronize your design data directly to an iModel on the iModel Hub using the iTwin synchronizer. This opens up powerful new collaboration workflows for teams of any size. Component Center integration is now a released feature in the Connect Edition Update 14. Component Center is a cloud service that enables you to store and share libraries of content and access them directly from within MicroStation. Building upon the power of property-driven workflows, the new item type EC expressions in MicroStation will open up a whole new world of possibilities for automating the creation of calculated fields that build upon the property data you're attaching to your elements. In addition to being able to perform class detection in a variety of flexible workflows right from within MicroStation, you can now view levels in nested preferences in the Clash Detection dialog box. You can also define jobs in levels of nested references. This does still require a separate Clash Detection Visa license. MicroStation now includes the ability to define a Geographic Coordinate System, or GCS, and provides the tools to create and edit new GCSs, ellipsoid or datum, in a user-defined library. This new library can be shared with all users using a configuration variable. MicroStation Connect Edition Update 14 is available for download, so we encourage you to check it out and jumpstart your productivity today.